everybody. Welcome back to Padfoot TD Games. My name is Zach. I am the voice behind the icon. We are here back in LSPDFR with our state trooper charger here in Grapeseed. We're going to see what kind of fun we can get into this evening and let's take some calls. Like there's a little coyote right there. Bye. Oh, don't get by car. <sighs> we have a person attempting to steal a car and grape seed. All right, we're just gonna call in from dispatch, letting us know that there seems to be a possible Grand Theft Auto happening here in Grape two. Seed. We want to head out code two. I'm actually a little hesitant to actually head out code three. If somebody's stealing somebody's car, now it's Grand Theft Auto. If the person's in it, vehicle theft otherwise, I don't know. Let's get on scene, let's see if we can help these people out. And if uh, there's nobody in the car while it's being carjacked, uh, at least they're out of harm's way. So let's get in here to Grape Seed and let's see what's going on. I'm gonna say it's right here. Whoa, hey, 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 what are you doing? Freeze, 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 hey, hey. Hands up, down the ground, right now, on your stomach. I don't even know what you were thinking. You saw me pulling up, I had lights. You heard the sirens, you must just be blind. What's your name, man? Deshaun Nelson? We are code four. Come here. No further units required. I'm gonna sit you in the back of my car for right now. <clears throat> Come on in, man. It's always a weird delay with this. Get in the car there we and go. Behave. Wanna care to explain what you were thinking there? Busting out a window right in front of a cop? I've seen smarter decisions and I've seen dumber, but that's right up there on the list with dumber. Man. So do you actually finish breaking in the window? Poor person's insurance. Yeah, there it is. Person's insurance is gonna go up. We'll make sure the dispatch contacts them and gets that all settled out. Let's get this guy's paperwork so we can get him off to jail. Deshaun, I have no idea what you were thinking. You mean just standing right there. Let's get into this cab. <clears throat> Looks like Ella's come to join us now. Hi, Ella. If you want to be in the squad car too, we can be a canine unit together. Hi. She's got her head on my lap right now. It's actually pretty funny. You can actually hear her tail smashing up against everything too. She's quite big. <laughs> Let's see, what are we getting you on? Uh, nope, not in traffic, property. It was attempted Grand Theft Auto, but we're still gonna give you with uh, Grand Theft Auto. It's a felony, man. They'll probably drop it down in court because you didn't actually officially get in there, but the intent was there, okay? Make better choices, okay? We're gonna get some backup down here, take you down to the station. Now let's decided to leave the room and now stand outside the door and stare at me. Well, what you doing, Yad? Can I come play? If you bring me a ball, I'll throw it. Nope, she's just more content on uh, sitting inside and just watching. <laughs> she likes the videos too. Yeah, definitely scum. Can't believe that, right in front of us. That's crazy. All right, dispatch, this situation's code four. We're 10-8, back on patrol here in Grapeseed. Attention all units, we've got a hit and run in Grapeseed. Dispatch, I'm actually right at that scene. I did not see which vehicle it was, but I'm gonna go investigate the patient right now. Whoa! I don't even know which person it's supposed to be. I believe it's the one over here on the ground, but that's ridiculous. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna close off this part of the road. Run, little coyote, run. You okay? Sir, are you okay over there? I saw you get hit by the truck. You good? I think you're supposed to be our witness. Come over here. You know what? Actually, actually, let's put up some barriers. Make sure this guy doesn't get hit anymore. And take the ambulance a little while to get here. Beautiful job with these barriers. 
<laughs> yeah, I wish. Looks like he's dead. Or hopefully he's not. But we want to just make sure nobody's trying to cut through. Probably should do the cones next time. Might be a little bit easier. Alright. Don't worry, man. Medical's right on the way, okay? Stick in there. No way. No way. So I'm gonna hang out with him really quick and... I was hoping to kneel, but there we go. It's gonna be okay, man. Stick with me, okay? We've got medics on their way. They're gonna take care of you, okay? We're gonna figure out who did this and what happened, okay? <clears throat> Cars, there's a lot of backup traffic. Dispatch, um, I would love an additional to my location to help with traffic control. Alright, so if we're looking here, we see no signs of any skid marks. The only thing is right here where the truck came to a stop where I assume... Well, vehicle came to a stop. Which I assume was on top of him since this one is bloody. Okay, paramedics are coming up right now. Fire's coming up behind. Blocking even more traffic. Mm, I love that ambulance so much. The guy did an amazing job with it. Oh, fire showed up in the Tahoe. That's kind of broken. That's a bummer. What do we got? I'm mean, just looking for somebody who hit and run or is hit and run with the charge of murder. I'll be right over with you in a second, sir. Come on, man, pull through. Those eyes just staring at me, though. I think he's blinking. <laughs> I'm gonna ignore that. Yes! Yes, they were able to save him, so that's awesome. All right, they're gonna get you down to the hospital. We're gonna figure out who did this to you, all right? Take a slow recovery. We'll have somebody down to the station, uh, down to the hospital in a bit to talk to you. Well, I'm glad that he's okay. Let's go over here and talk to this guy, see if he saw anything. Fighting with the camera here. Can I talk to you? Hello, did you see what, how this happened? Yes, a vehicle just came out of nowhere and struck him down. Can any of you, all one of you, tell me any information on the vehicle that was involved? Yes, sir. It was a Predator. What about the license plate? Did you happen to catch that at all? License plate was 62 Sierra Rivera Whiskey 450. Thank you for your time. The information will be very, very helpful in finding the suspect. An APB has been placed for that vehicle. Thank you, dispatch. We're gonna finish cleaning up our signs here. We're gonna reopen the road. Now he's off to the hospital. We're not gonna let that guy get his moment. We're gonna come over here. An APB has been put out for that vehicle. I don't think uh, it's going to show up. Maybe it'll show up later in game. So we're going to end that. <clears throat> Dispatch. We're off that call. There's a pig running down the street and across the road. Go, piggy, go. Attention, all units. We are code four. Attention, all units. Assistance required in Grande Sonora Desert. Two males are outside, fighting outside of a bar. Yeah, these two are racing. We're just going to ignore that that's happening. We're going to respond to this bar fight really quick. I believe it's in Sandy Shores. Bunnies! Ooh. <laughs> this bunnies just barely made it. Dispatch, we're en route to that bar fight, Code 3. Come on, give me room, give me room, give me room. There we go. So the two males are outside fighting, so at least they're not inside, but of course we're a little far out, so hopefully it doesn't get out of hand before we get there. There might be another unit on scene. I know once in a while with these calls, they'll have another unit sent out. It'll be secondary, which is fine by me. 
trying to get there as fast as we can. But this traffic is ridiculous. It's 6.44 at night. He's getting off work, getting ready to go home. It's a beautiful night here in Sandy Shores. You can see this, a beautiful sunset going down, which we'll enjoy uh, after we go break up this fight. Uh, looking at our GPS, it looks like it's going to be down at the Yellow Jack, so... A little bit further to go. I know I'm really far on that left side of the road, hoping that we can split here. Trying to keep it to a semi-realistic speed. Of course, the Charger's not as super primed as I want it to be. It's going to be down here at the Yellow Jack. Yeah, definitely is. Excuse us, pardon us. Hopefully we can get this scene under control. Don't stop. <laughs> Don't stop the meter. All right, let's turn this off. Hey, 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 hey. There's no... Hey, 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 hey. Both of you, knock it off. Knock it off. You too. You too. Hey, put your hands up. Hey, knock it off, or I'll tase both of you. Not you, waiter. Now he's gonna go down too. Guys should have just listened. All right. Right now you're both being detained to like figure out what's going on. Okay. Come on over here. You'll kneel, kneel down right here where I can see you. Okay. Like I just told him, you're not under arrest, you're just being detained right now until we can figure out what's going on. I don't believe a lying eyes. Well, believe it, man. You throw punches, cops are gonna be called. They're gonna come, they're gonna pick you up. Do me a favor, kneel down on the ground there, okay? So, I think with him, we need to talk to him, but... He thinks he's under arrest, so what we're going to do is we're going to stand him up, and then we're going to release him. There you go, sir. That was just a formality to help you get off the ground. Do me a favor. Can you talk to us about what's going on here? I'm just going to walk off into the night? All right. Listen up, guys. You're both throwing punches. Okay? I don't know if you just had too much to drink or what. That kind of crap's not allowed here, especially if the cops get called on you. All right? Right now, we're going to write it off, this public fighting, aggressor. I don't even know if I can hear your sides of the stories. Okay? So for right now, I'm just going to bring you... You guys are both going to go down. You both look like you're drunk. You're going to go to the sober tank, different rooms. You're going to sleep it off. You understand? You're going to call that here again. You're going to jail. Yeah, we can send them down the same wagon. You seem like they're going to be calm now. Pulling in right now. <clears throat> Thank you, dispatch. Is he have us plastered through a wall? Come on over. Attention, all units. We are code four. Yeah, it's these two guys. They're just gonna go sleep it off. Make better decisions in the future. What an ass. Dispatch, we're code four here. Both of them are in custody and heading to the station. I'm 10 8. That is one beautiful sunset. I'm telling you, the developers of this game really outdid themselves. And of course, we got mods in here to make it look a little bit better, but just the beauty that this game has. Attention all units, we have a traffic alert in, uh, Grande Sonora Desert. Units respond code 3. Why not? So this stolen bike call just came in. They're with flowing traffic in the Grande Sonora Desert. They want us to respond code 3. I think that might be a little bit overkill, but... I don't know. It could be something a lot major, more major, than uh, what we're making it out to be. 
scoot on over here. Perfect. Thank you for letting us through. <clears throat> now, uh, they weren't clear if it was whether a bicycle or whether it was a motorcycle. Okay, or just stop in the middle of the road. That should be fine, too. Regardless, stolen property is stolen property, so we're going to get up here and figure out what's going on. There we go. Dispatch, I'm right now at East Joshua. I believe they've gone to Sandy Shores. Oh. Sorry, Dispatch, apparently I can't talk. Uh, it's a bicycle. Let's see if we can get him to stop. Nope. Okay, let's make sure everybody's on safe mode. And I guess we're off on a pursuit with a pedal bike. We're going to call in another unit just in case he goes down an alleyway. The problem is, is I'm worried about that unit pulling right out in front of him. Or, or he just jumping right in. <clears throat> I've got non-lethal. He's down. He's down. I've got you covered. Got you covered. You were going straight to jail, asshole. Got him in the angle if need be. Here we go. Dispatch. Suspects in custody. Attention all units. Officers report. We are code four. No further units required. All right, well, we didn't get the arrest, but tell you what, I'm glad that he's going to be off the street. Very nice sheriff unit. Uh, run around here really quick. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stolen and might as well break it, too. Go. Can you get off the bike? I'm trying to get, <laughs> trying to get somebody out here. Oh, yep, 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 yep. It was totally in that condition when uh, somebody stole it, right? Uh, this is going to be the stupidest thing ever, but I've called the insurance company on a pedal bike. Now, don't get me wrong. These are probably super expensive. But, uh, might be a little bit overkill. Just going to get over here to the side of the road. You good? And insurance is here to grab it. Here you guys go. I know, one of the weirdest things ever. I'm just going to watch you pedal away on that. Thank you guys for taking care of that. Well... We're code four. Ah, the situation's code four. We're ten eight off of that dispatch. We're available for calls. And there he goes, just pedaling off into the night. <laughs> All right, we're see this F one fifty in here, acting just super erratic, and he's crashing into things. Let's see. Or an easy way in there without breaking the gate. Okay, dispatch. We're going to be in pursuit of a Ford F-150 heading west on Marina. He's got a pretty good amount of speed. Whoa, okay. Sir siren always helps. It's gray in color. It's got a cap. Four-door, I believe. Now that we got him stopped, let's get into CAD here and see what's going on with that vehicle itself. It says it's a bison, it's a Ford F 150, valve to a Laura Anderson. I'm pretty sure I saw a male subject in there. It could be just borrowing, it could be a friend, but we don't know. So let's approach this as it possibly could be a stolen vehicle. Hello, sir. Zach with the Los Santos County Sheriff's Department. Uh, let's see. Can I have your license registration? Let's start with that. Jack Hoff. All right, Jack, do me a favor. Stick tight. I'm just going to run your information really quick. All right, so this is start, starts to be red flag number one. He was actually very erratic. Tried getting out of there very fast. Um, 
crashing through the gate, of course. So we're going to run him to see if he's wanted for anything. He's not the registered RO. Yet again, it could be a friend. So we'll we'll see where that goes after that. Jack Hoff. Time stop one. What you arrest, What you've been arrested for? Burglary. Well, that's not looking good for you already, Jack. All right. <clears throat> Dispatch, we may have a stolen vehicle out here. I'm going to keep you posted. All right, let's go up here and let's just ask him really quick if he owns a vehicle. Here's your license back, Jack. Can you do me a favor? Can you just answer me one question? Uh, do you own this vehicle? I'd like to invoke my right to not say anything in response to that. All right, do me a favor then. Step on out of the vehicle. Jesus. Stop! Police! At this point, I am detaining you. All right, you're not under arrest 100% yet, but you're not coming back as registered owner. You won't answer my questions. So this is how we're going to have to treat it, okay? We can always call the owner of this vehicle. They can clear you. But if you're not willing to talk, we're going to bring you down for Grand Theft Auto. Okay. Do me a favor, sit in the vehicle. Uh, the reason I'm not pressing G right now is because I haven't changed the quick key and we'll just grab a machine gun out of the trunk. <laughs> <coughs> so. Come on, you. Don't be a dick. Just get in the car. Ugh. Right now you have the right to remain silent as you have uh, started already. You have the right to attorney if you cannot afford one. Things that you do say after... Uh, <laughs> just screwed that up completely. Let's try that again. Right now you're under under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If one if you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you by the state. Do you understand these rights? And quiet is all quiet can be. That's fine. That's your choice. But right now you're going to go down for Grand Theft Auto unless you're willing to speak to us about something different. All right. Let's get a tow truck down here for this. Since it wasn't reported stolen, I'm not going to call the insurance company. Uh, let's actually check the vehicle really quick. I should have checked him, but he's already in the car. Let's see if there's anything that implies that it's been stolen. An air freshener. Well, common. So right now, dispatch any tow truck for an F-150 out to my location on Algonquin Boulevard, please. Thank you. All right, let's get his paperwork written up and get him out of here. Tell you, man, if you were just willing to work with us, it could have been a lot different. If your friend let you borrow this, it would have been completely fine. But right now, we have to go on all the evidence that we have that shows that this vehicle is not yours. We have a person attempting to steal a car. In and we're going to ignore that, too. That uh, it's, it's just not making sense. Okay, so right now you are going to be charged with Grand Theft Auto. You can plead your case to the court, but while being silent can't really do much. So let's get a transport down here to get you out of here. Backup needed for a suspect placed under arrest. Dispatch, can I have PT down to my location on Algonquin, please? Copy that, dispatch. Yep. Okay, just can't look at that truck one more time. Thanks, guys. And it floats. <laughs> a nice sheriff car. Looks really good. Might do it a couple episodes in that. I like the all blues, personally. All right, uh, dispatch. We're ten eight. All right, everybody. That's gonna do it for us this episode. Thanks for hanging out and thanks for coming out to watch this video. I really do enjoy these series. Sometimes they're a little bit harder to get together with possible game crashes here and there. But I hope you enjoyed it too. It was another successful patrol, got some bad guys behind bars, and saw some unique events. So thank you guys for hanging out. Like I said, if you like what you saw, you can always hit the subscribe button. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know what you think of it, maybe down in the comments as well. Uh, we do a lot of streaming if you like what you see on the channel on twitch.tv slash padfoottd. And of course, we're on YouTube at padfoottdgames uh, on YouTube. I can't say .com because that doesn't make any sense. But thank you guys for coming out to this one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.